Keeping our eye on the roads on the Interstate 95 area right now. The ABC 7 traffic tracker out there. Are things moving uh, rather well, it looks like right now, but uh, there are a lot of cars on the road and it's still raining out there, folks. So be careful if you're going to be hitting the roads. Well, this blast of winter on one of the busiest travel days of the year is causing a lot of problems for those traveling, as you saw there, by car or even by plane. Stephen Cheatham went out to go check out delays and cancellations at the airports and to see how passengers are faring during this early winter storm. Take a look. Flights are taking off at area airports for people like those behind me going through security. They're the lucky travelers. They have tickets for planes that are going to be taking to the skies, but we found a lot of people who encountered either delays or cancellations, and they're the folks you usually find hanging out at airport restaurants. Of all the days to get hit with snow, sleet, and stinging wind, one of the busiest days of the year for air travel. The flight was originating in Raleigh, and the weather down there was exceptionally bad. The delays started early and kept coming, eventually leading to a string of cancellations. And when we put our scan in, to our, our ticket in to have it scanned, it said flight had been canceled. The bad weather busted up travel and Thanksgiving plans, leaving some thwarted passengers scrambling to come up with alternate routes. Some, though, just couldn't get off the ground. Three different families are not going to be able to be together. As for those people whose flights are not taking off today and they couldn't get on a flight tomorrow either, well, some of them say they are going to be making other travel plans and hoping for better prospects come Christmas. Stephen Cheetah, ABC 7 News.